Hello friends, let me walk you through a project that I was, I was working on. So it is a Arduino based project I have been working on. So this is a Whirlpool White Magic 7kg semi-automatic washing machine. So it has all the knobs to operate the washing machine. So I have been working over this machine from past some time to convert it into an automatic machine using an Arduino. So I have designed a circuit board. So this circuit board has a Arduino, then it, ha it has LCD connectors and it has some relays to control the motor, to control the water and the drain and, and the switchboard. So these are my uh, circuit boards that I printed earlier, so, so that I'm not using them anymore. So let's keep it. these are just for demo purposes. So on this machine, if you see, I'll walk you through all the components that I have installed. So there is a 16 by 2 LCD. Then I have four buttons to control all the functions of the washing machine. So on the back side of the washing machine, if you see, this is a solenoid valve. So I have installed it to control the water inlet for the machine. So then I'm not able to sure uh, like if you are able to see. So there is a polythene wrapped. Uh, this is my actual circuit board. It is uh, fitted in behind this. So it is a Arduino, uh, uh, Arduino based uh, circuit. So it is running on Atmega 328P microcontroller, which is bootloaded with Arduino. Then uh, over here is my power supply. So this is to supply uh, power up my electronic circuitry. So then over here and below you will see two these two wires so these are my drain sensors uh, to sense any water uh, in the drain so these are just stick into the drain so then I also ordered a solenoid for opening of the drain so if you see like so this drain how this drain works so I have to pull this up uh, for opening the drain so I ordered a solenoid to for the same so this is a pull push pull solenoid but it doesn't have a sufficient power to pull this up so I need to figure out a way to open this drain using servo motor or some more powerful solenoid so currently uh, my drain is drain opening is not automated so I have to do, do it manually so if you see uh, I have, I can do it using the button. <coughs> uh, this is the complete part of the backend electronics. So then also there is a water level sensor. So inside the machine I have fitted a water level sensor behind this. So it is having a three level low, medium and high. Let me see if I can pull this out. So I stick this inside. It's very solid. So this is the water inlet pipe that comes from the solenoid valve. So, so once the valve turns on, the water inlet will start. Uh, so let me just set up this machine and we'll fire it up and see if it works. So here I have all this machine set up. So if you will see, I have connected it to the water supply. Uh, then I have just connected the power supply for the machine. And on the board yeah if you are able to see it is asking me to select the wash mode so i have three wash modes i can wash rinse wash plus rinse then let, let me select the wash mode as wash then it is asking for the water level so after if i select the water level uh, it is low medium and high so i'll select it as low so then it's wash time so it maximum you can select 15 minutes minimum one minute so i'll select it as one minute then it it is asking it is filling up the water i forgot to switch on the tap so you see now the machine is filling up the water so it will take some time uh, i'll get back to you once the machine is filled up with water so if you see after the water filling up completed uh, it switched on the machine so now it will wash 
complete the wash cycle and then it will show us uh, then it will finish so, so that's a small demo of how this fully automatic washing machine works